Welcome, welcome everybody. I have a special Leviathan Clan Wars compilation for you. Today we're going to show if Grenadiers are viable again in Clan Wars, particularly as a Leviathan. This first episode we're taking on a Cricket Leviathan. He's got some dogs protecting him. Porcupine build. Trying to escape, and I get stuck right here, trying to pass the tree, and I hit the tree. Hard to control this kind of big monstrosity of a car. The porcupine build getting me stuck here. This could very Shit, well be the end now. of my Leviathan if I can't get out of it. My team does a great job of covering me Ooh, as I try and get out of here so I can make another entrance. Coming back in, I thought I had the upper hand and I could sneak past him, but some volleys got me out of cloak, so I couldn't get behind him as I wish I could have. He took off some wheels, so it was a little difficult to maneuver out of this. Oh no. The opponent came in, perfect timing, to block all of those cricket shots, or majority of them, from hitting me as I made a daring entrance and escape. Bringing home a well-deserved win, baby. All right, going into round two, I was really comfortable, really confident <laughs> after dealing with the Cricket Leviathan in the first round. Let's see what happens this time. They thought they could get the advantage on me by sitting on the hill and potentially sending their spark fire dog at me. Fire build comes in, he can't quite chew through the armor. <laughs> he has to retreat, all those drones. Can't really use his spark very well, you know, he can kind of slow down what's in front of him. And while the Leviathan and the dog build were busy with me, I tried to take off and try to single out the other two builds on the enemy team. Oh, that's not. And this epic fail is brought to you by Shock Radio. Using the barriers like cheap cat cans, I put those down and evade, hoping to get the fireboat stuck. Still getting shot at by Reavers. And this build truly excels behind cover. I'll go with my man, dude. I had to rush over there and, and uh, save one of my teammates. So I realized what was happening with the radar after he said that. And seeing him kind of getting pinned oh, up under the bridge there. Right, coming down there with the going down. Okay. Racing to help Shaver out. Barriers are so sweet, man. <laughs> I got a kill. <laughs> that was an excellent first round against uh, one of the meta in Glenwood. <laughs> Dude, this build is so freaking fun. I swear. <laughs> These Leviathans pose a particular challenge because they're so damn. I love when a flute builds cloak with a red laser beam sticking out of their car, like. 
they will light a beam leading to your car. Right there coming past me, a dog build past me while I was chasing the flute build. I'm just pushing this guy around. Sorry, buddy. Here's the Leviathan. I had to get behind him. Most of his weapons really can't fire behind him. So you see I kind of just zip past, dropped a bunch of drones, and just took cover. My children are are doing all the work for me. The shotgunner came in, hoping he can do a number to me, eventually take me out. It's a huge cluster mess in this uh, hole up here, but... Stall him. There's no way he can shoot all these drones. But he's chewing through me pretty good, so this is dangerous for me. Ultimately, getting the kill. Face my drones like a man! Shout out to my team for letting my drones get the final kill here. Loot <laughs> <laughs> guy is still doing the cloaking thing while he has his flutes shooting right through his build. If you're watching this, flute guy, don't shoot your flutes and cloak. Single the flute guy out again. Oh, I got the brick on me. When in doubt, just spam. Spam, spam, spam. that tankiness I'm talking about here. Otherwise it is mean. The Leviathans can't shoot what they can't see. Barriers for days, bruh. Barriers for days. hard to rush my team. <clears throat> now, I'm not a very or a very helpful Leviathan. Like 
I can't do anything other than drop drones. Um, my team is getting absolutely wrecked and I can't do a whole lot about it. So it's a bit of a struggle if you're my team <laughs> and I'm playing this build. Slamming in the crit guy, I can do that. I can run into people pretty good. These drones absolutely deal some damage to regular builds. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just so many of them. This is a tanky Leviathan. play here, Shaper's like limping. If he goes to cap, he has to cap it out while I kind of keep them from capping. Shit, drones popping. Dumbass. This guy kind of tries to rush me and ends up flipping. So freaking magical. It might have been trouble for me if he would have not flipped there. My build's looking pretty rough right now. Are you serious right now? The base is empty. Oh, I'm not in there. Shit. I thought I was protecting the cap, but I wasn't in enough to actually stop the cap. I had to rush in from behind cover. <laughs> right. This build is designed to take a beating. It is designed to take the punishment. Yeah, I don't Beautiful. Know First round win. Shaper was able to capitalize and cap the base while I distracted at our cap. Let's see what round two has. This guy kind of just tried to rush me. He did pretty good as a port build, so porcupines kind of have a strength against this Leviathan here. It's just like the fire. He's afraid of Helios. Because he's that big and he'll like... just take his health away. Again, the Houdini trick. Pop in a, in a barrier, cloak it up, disappear. Of course, I didn't do much disappearing this time. Just kind of like sat there. This build is absolutely hilarious, though. Constantly just kind of running around, dropping these drones. And the, the super ironic thing is, this is a Leviathan that you kind of aim. I choose when and where I want to drop my drones. This Leviathan cannot choose to shoot me. I have to be within sight of it. It can't move its weapons. It has no control over when and where its Leviathan fires. At least with this kind of build, you can control. I have control over every weapon on my Leviathan. My cloak, you know, my barriers, my drones.
super cheap build too if you like compare the cost uh this grenadier leviathan is, is relatively inexpensive to make my drones my drones my drones aren't loading i think all the bigfoot tires are the most expensive thing on this build maybe the apollo generator <laughs> He's chasing me. <laughs> A lot of people mentioned that maybe I should try small tracks. But they don't recharge grenadiers. As soon as I get my drones back, you're dead, buddy. Big circles! But they don't help the uh, cheetah engine. I really appreciate everybody checking out my YouTube channel, checking out my YouTube videos. All the music on my channel is, uh, for the most part, 100% original. You can find me at SoundCloud, as well as YouTube and Twitch. Thank you, guys. <laughs> <laughs> uh.